Hello everyone, back to another episode of Super Mario Galaxy 2 and I'm finally back and you're like, what? You're finally back? What? What, what happened? Well, this is like the first time r me recording after my surgery. Well, I did record like more like co-op yesterday, but it was like, I gotta work and then it's like super late and well, you know, so this is like the real uh, computer stuff. And this is really the first time of me recording again after my surgery. It will still sound a bit, you know, funny, but um, my my cheeks are quite quite swollen up still. But, you know, I love you guys, so I'm doing this for you. And um, you know, I might even tell the story of what happened. Oh my god, this is so nice. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna do first. Uh, some easy world. First, I'm gonna choose the world, then I'm gonna tell ya. All about my surgery! Um, I might do slip sand or ship burn. No ship burn, I feel like ship burn. Slip sand, whatever. So, um. <coughs> uh, what my surgery was is that my, um. My wisdom theater being pulled out. <coughs> well, were pulled out. You know? All four of them so I had to get in you know and you're not allowed to eat after midnight right because you have to be sober for the surgery <coughs> so um you know like a good girl I didn't eat at all and um, well it took quite quite a long time till I could like get my surgery done it was like how late was it I think it was one o'clock like in the afternoon till I got operated, so I hadn't ate for like 13 hours. That was quite sober. <laughs> I was quite sober, yeah. And then you know I had to, you know those those like hospitals, you know series where you have to put those like dresses on where you can see your ass in it. Oh yeah, those. Oh shit, how do I get over there? Wait, tunnel. Yeah, I got to ward those. Well, you couldn't see my ass, and I could just, you know, kept most of the things I had. So it was... Ah! Wow, okay, I didn't think that would hit me for some reason. Oh, run. Okay. And... Again! God damn it! Right, climb on it, you jackass! Okay, whatever. Um, and my phone rings at the perfect time. Sorry about that. It's my WhatsApp. Ah, god damn it! Luckily, I have like six life. But yeah, I had to like get in and dig for the shizzle, and you know, uh, I was I was not so scared about the pain it would come along with. It was more the falling asleep part, you know, putting the needle in, injecting the like the stuff in it, you know, it's not my fun. But uh it was it was pretty okay. It was really okay. I Wow, what it just happened? That's stupid. Um No, it was really, really okay. Really. I I was surprised. So it took me in on this operation table, like Super creepy, you know, you're gonna get operated, you're like, those little big machines and everything, you're like, oh shit. And the first thing, like, my mom was with me, and then I got, like, my dress on, and, like, a little hairnet, you know, like, like the real ones, you know. I feel like a real patient, never been to the hospital before. <laughs> and, um, you know, after 10 minutes, she plucked me up, got me to the operating table. And uh, I had to lay down on this thing, and then, like, my head was... Oh, wow, okay. Um, like, uh, that was, like, a weird bed, but the, the head thing where you had to put your head on was, like, kind of low. It, um... It was kind of annoying to... to lay down, but then she put it higher, and it was fine, but... You know, it was chisel. And then, um, the anesthetic came. Fun guy, fun guy. And, um, well, yeah, she, like, uh, did things for my blood and, uh, you died. And, you know, it was, it was kind of scary first, but when she put, like, 
uh, thing in for um, for my blood and, and to put the like antibiotics in and everything. You know. Oh my god, you're so gonna die, motherfucker! Stop! Ugh. Oh, fine. Don't. Um. Yeah, the anesthetic came, and he um. It's just when he puts in the, the liquid in for you to fall asleep it feels so heavy in your like feels so heavy in your arm and like in your throat i felt that in my throat but it was like kind of painful it was not a nice feeling and you know the next thing that happened i remember the woman saying to me you had like the nicest nail polish ever and i was like oh gee thanks <laughs> i was like dude i'm gonna get operated like what are you talking about my nails <laughs> but it was you know friendly she tried to keep me no from falling into the sand and dying no she tried to keep me away from you know being nervous and shit and I just died at the end. I need to stop talking. I really can't talk you. I'm talking. It's really bad. But, uh, you know, she was a very nice lady. Very optimistic. And then my doctor came, you know, the woman. The old woman. The yeah, anesthetic was pretty much the only guy in the room. But uh, then I wake up. The next minute I wake up in this weird room. There's like everywhere for people waking up and. Like, I woke up, and I tried to fight, because, like, I was like, oh, whatever, let me sleep. But, uh, no, no, I, like, tried to wake up, and I was like, dude, surgery's done. We can sleep later. You know, stuff like, I don't know how much I slept, I think it's two hours. I s the amount I slept. God damn it, Kimmick, shit you. Ugh, whatever, you dying. Um, yeah. And then she brought me to my room. I got a, you know, that thing in your arm with antibiotics and painkillers, whatever. And uh, for some reason, there was no room left for patient, uh, for the wisdom teeth patient. So they put me with like the old people. It was like a bit weird and a bit odd because I had like a lot of old people farting. Yeah, no, not so nice when you're just done surgery and those people are like you know not happy and it was like fucking 20 degrees in my room it was so hot it was so fucking annoying i'm just gonna jump it Ugh. so close so fucking close it's me talking i can't concentrate really i'm sorry to finish on my story <laughs> tell where to go yes um back to my room so you know well, it was kind of like 16 hours, uh, I think around 5, like 17 hours, so I haven't ate shit, and I had to use the bathroom, you know, because I'm still a human, and, you know, I had to pee, man, and, um, so I had this, this thing in my arm, you know, with the tube and everything, shizzle, damn, almost, so yeah, there it comes. Get me down, bitches! Freeze! So not fair. You're going down. No, we're not. So stay alive then. And. No, you. No, fine. You don't. Go down. But what were we gonna say? So yeah, I had to pee. So I had to get up from my bed because I was laying down pretty much the whole time. And, um. Yeah, I got up and my blood pressure just told me. Like, instantly. Like. Go fuck yourself, pretty much. So I kind of fainted, and you know, it was hot, and then like I haven't eaten for like 17 hours. Or when like like a morning surgery, you know, you get in like at 10, and then you you get back at home like around noon, right? No, not with me. Shut up my bird, you stupid thing. Come here, come here. I'm almost there, I'm almost there. Blah, 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 finally. I totally turned into like a fucking turkey, but okay. Um. So yeah, that was it. I kind of faced, she put, had to like push me onto the bed again. 
and uh, I got hot and I got like very nauseous uh, nauseous like I was not feeling well in my stomach I think I, I thought I had to throw up but I didn't because I was very happy that didn't happen because I hate throwing up like it's the worst thing ever and um, yeah then um, I had to drink one full glass of water before I was allowed to leave and I, I was allowed to leave at 6.30 7 so after like 18 19 hours and not eating anything I asked for a yogurt you know just for the shizzle um, I'm gonna do this one whatever so then I ate my yogurt tried to get me dressed up still in the dress thing oh no this Ugh. I hate this this sucks. Why did I do that? I got like 50 seconds. Whatever, man. I'm doing this. I don't think I'll get them all. I know it's my birthday. Uh, so yeah, I finally got home. Hey, it wasn't too bad. I changed my like, ice packs every two hours. I was just fucking sorry. So that was good. Not too much pain. I expected more. If you had braces before, that is nothing compared with this. Like, braces are way worse than this. And I missed three Goombas. What the hell? Stupid. For some reason, there's always, like, one, like, invisible Goomba. I noticed that before you get really I'm gonna show you like try to get them all again. You might feel like this for a while, but Yana! Yeah, try my best here. Uh like you'll see the count, just keep counting with me, right? This one is for the chisel! Can I hit this one, man? The fucker. I got him. And this one. I didn't get this one either. Uh man, I'm bad at perspective. So bad. Man, hit those fucking Goombas, Mario, you shitty motherfucker. Come on, the pink one too. It's not because it's pink, you can you know, ignore him. No, you gotta hit him too. 28, 29, apparently this is 30. So that's good. Well, uh, to finish up my story, uh, when I had to dress up, I had to stand up again. So my blood pressure was like, again, you know, fuck yourself. You don't need me. So I was feeling very bad. She brought me like a wheelchair kind of thing. It's not really a wheelchair. It was like more of like a riding couch. I don't know. It was not really a wheelchair if you get me. Um, it was kinda, but it wasn't so you can rent. It's not really, really. Oh, well, you know what I mean. Then I got to the car and got home and you know was happy. That was it. And uh, the pain was, yeah, it was okay. It was. You know, to paint. What do you want? Hey, you have 77 power stars. I'm lucky. Why? Why is 77 like such a weird number? Like, yeah, if you double it, it's like. I don't. What I'm gonna do next? I still have Boo Moon. Ugh. Uh, I'm gonna do Boo Moon. Whatever, man. I don't know. <laughs> So yeah, that was quite an experience. So, if you have to get your wisdom teeth removed, you know, it's not even a week since I've been, you know, operated. Teeth got operated, what? Um, and I'm pretty held up, healed up, held up. For some reason, I also held up, but it's healed up. You motherfucking asshole. Um... I didn't get, like, I couldn't get my, like, report from school because I was operated. Mm, heading the wrong way again. I can feel it. I'm gonna end up somewhere not where I want to be. Fuck's sake. Whatever, man. Stay away from me, you bow. Can I jump through that picture? That would be cool. No, okay. Um. I don't know where to go, man. Where am I? You fuck yourself. Oh, door's opening. 
I'm just gonna follow the coins. Why is he taking me? Ooh, he's secret. It ain't it. Oh, that's what I want. That's where I needed to go, man. Da -da 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 -da. Boo, Mario. And if you, like, shake, you can, like, disappear and go through this. Which is nice. It's, you know, it's cool. And then press A to levitate. Those things make those nasty sound. This is just so nasty. Pressing the A button like a crazy button. Uh, so I'm glad I can, like, record again because I miss it so much. And I started working as well. So it's like I'm doing like five, six, eight hours a day, depends on what day. And uh, I'm the sweet swimsuit department. But I'll tell you more next time, you know, because this time it's wisdom teacher. Shizzle, whatever. Wait. I do not need anything, do I? Nope, I don't think so. My comp medal? Did I get it? Yeah, I get it. Because that was like the most obvious thing ever. Oh my god. Okay, can I get, like, uh, through this? Oh no! No! Oh wow, I got lucky. Dude, I totally hit that. That is so unfair. Wait, did anyone just screw that thing? Did you see that? I just went through him. Dude, this game is so glitched up. It's so funny. So yeah, I'm not as enthusiastic as I am usually am. Because uh, I want to spare my mouth, pretty much. You know, I'm not going to go, ooh, like I usually am. But take it easy, you know, take it easy. Recording some more. Support my you galaxy. Because I want to help you kind of that way. Because it's a really long one. I Like, Scout Sword and Super Mario Galaxy. What was in my mind? What do we have here? It looks like a soft white mushroom, hey? You know, the stuff you're finding is pretty weird, but I guess that's just the universe we live in, right? Har-har? No? Fine, man. I don't care. So let's go outside. To, you know, save as a great outro, whatever. Yeah, so that was my uh, story for today. Anything happening interesting in my life is surgery and work. <laughs> It's pretty much I have a life no not really but um yeah you know I just gonna finish it here 17 minutes pretty good so guys this was the age of music and we were playing Super Mario Galaxy 2 and I hope you enjoy have a good day bye bye